Check me out. Let me check it out. You got me mesmerized with that black hair and the fat ass thighs. Street poetry is my everyday. But yo, I gotta stop so you try my way. If I was working at the club, you would not pay. Hey yo, my man Fife Diggy, he got something to say. Hey, I like him brown, yeah, I'm Puerto Rican or Haitian. I was about to go my own race. Zulu Nation. <laughs> you was about to go with your own shit. Come up with my own race. H Town. You got DVD on your bedroom wall. I'm not in that. This is how I ball. I'm not in that. So I read somewhere that the essence of being human is that one does not seek perfection. But I'm like, fuck all that. I want my shit to be perfect, on point, at all times. And honestly, that's been the biggest delay in all of my music. All my homies call me a perfectionist. I need every sound, every syllable, everything to be at the highest point that it can be. I'm not saying that I'm perfect, but I'm just trying to create that perfect moment with the song. But if that don't make me human, then what does that make me? So my baby boy is finished. I swear to God. Ain't no way to hell to get it. I swear to God. I swear to God, I don't get it. That ain't blocking you, bro. I swear to God. There's a button you can click that'll kind of show the, the way to the camera. There's only way you can do that shit on here. Do it, bro. Hey, nigga, I just woke up. You ready? Yeah. Hey, turn the headphones up, bro. All right, so this right here, this is a clip of hey. me recording the song that I came hey. up with called Get It. Huh? Now, basically, it, it, you know, it talks about the struggle of, you know, not having money at this moment or, you know, you down bad or you got to get up. You got to get it. You got to get that hustle on. This song did not make the EP at all. I mean, don't get me wrong. I love the hook. The hook was strong as fuck, you know what I'm saying? But it wasn't me in terms of that's not where I was going with this project. I wrote like six verses to the song and I hated every last one of them. Scribbling this word out, scribbling this line out, reconstructing a whole verse like eight times. It just goes into me being a perfectionist, like I said. I just need my stuff, whatever I'm doing to be my all, all that I can give it at that moment. And it just wasn't coming out that way. Mama, I feel like the greatest. We made it up out of the basement. Remember when they didn't listen to what I was saying? Now I, I strive for perfection in everything, every song that I do. You know, every graphic that I make, every this, every that. And every time that I do that, it causes me to overthink the process. And sometimes it creates this little love-hate relationship that I have with creation. As it is because I want everything to be the best. And if I see flaws or if I see that this is not looking right, this is not sounding right, this is not that, my mouth movement in the video is not right, it won't come out. In turn, y'all don't see all of the work that I'm actually doing behind the scenes. Uh, feel like I'm on top of the world. So I know this might sound funny, but I always wanted to be signed to good music. I always wanted to work with Kanye because he's one of the people that I feel like puts his all into his music. You can tell that he's a perfectionist. Whether you like it or not, everything is perfect. And so everything that I do, I always ask myself, I'm like, will Kanye approve of this? And if it don't, if he wouldn't, that shit's not coming out. This shit going in the trash immediately.